since it is spring, I decided I'm going to go ahead and declutter my winter clothes. I feel like it makes it easier now that the season has passed so that I can look at the clothes, see which ones I wore, see which ones I constantly put back every time that I took it out because I thought, oh, maybe I'll, I'll try this one this time. And then I always put it back. I can get rid of those. And then I know I have some shoes that I need to go through a little bit. I am in a different closet than my last closet declutter. And it's a little bit tighter, but I do want to make it a little bit more roomy in here. I feel like it is a little bit tight on the the rods in here but i'm excited to do this i also want to try to figure out something to do with my sweaters i don't know if i should put them in a box so that they just stay fresh and clean while they're not being worn otherwise they just need to be reorganized some i'm just gonna start right here i really think i should probably fold up my scrubs and put them in a box these are one thing that I'm struggling to get rid of because these are still so good and if I would need them, they'd be perfect. I just don't know if I'll need them again. So I'm gonna fold these up, but I'm gonna just make some piles on my bed for ones that I need to fold and donate and trash. I think most will be donate. I don't know if there's many that are actually trash in here. sweatshirt I just do not like the look of it I don't know if it's the stripes or the colors but I want a little bit more fun and playful and this does not really give me that I don't feel good in it so I'm not gonna keep it these two shirts I'm struggling with so this one I feel like it's just a good dressy shirt, so I think I'm still gonna keep it because I think in the spring it'll also be good as something over my tank tops. I'm gonna keep that. This I'm struggling with because it kind of gives me a similar feel to the sweatshirt that I just put over on the bed, but hmm. I know there's a whole saying that if it's not a yes, it's a no, but I'm going to come back to this one. I'm also going to change any of the clothes that are not on these felt hangers to the felt hangers, at least my nicer clothes. I don't really care as much about my t-shirts. Okay. I literally have three gray turtleneck shirts. This one I like. I'm going to keep this. It's also great because the armpits are loose, so if you're ever sweating in this, you can't really see it, even though it still is gray. This neck is a low-hanging neck, and it just isn't super flattering down here. So I'm going to take this one off, and this one is so soft, and I wear it a lot, so I'm going to keep this one. I do not feel good in this. I just feel like it's a little frumpy, maybe. This, oh. This shirt, I don't usually uh, wear it, wear it. Well, I don't wear it on my upper body. I wear it around my waist when I wear one of my dresses because I just like the look of it. This is more summery. This one, on the other hand, I don't wear. I think if I ever actually need a flannel, then I can probably go through to the thrift store if I'm needing to find one for an event. This is just completely see-through. It's kind of cheap and I don't really like the look of it. I really thought I would have donated this shirt by now, but it's just literally so soft and so comfy. I wear it under sweatshirts. I really don't think I love this anymore. It is very high neck and blocky. It's not really the look I'm wanting to go for. This is 
is another one of those shirts that I'll tie around my waist, but I don't know if I want to keep three of these. It's so soft. I'm going to try to wear it this spring and summer and see how that goes. Otherwise, it is definitely going to go. This is just not flattering on me. I don't like the, it's super high in the front and super low. And then when I tuck it in, it's just a lot of material. So I'm not a fan. This is one of those shirts that I would constantly pull out because I like the color and then I would put it on, look at myself in the mirror and realize that I don't like it and then put it right back up. So I'm glad I'm finally getting rid of this. This shirt also, it's a little sentimental because my brother got it for me, but I think it's time to go. It was good for when I was in this stage of life where I liked this shirt, but it's not the biggest fan of it anymore. Hopefully someone else will like it better. This shirt is actually a lounging shirt, so I am going to put it into my dresser instead. These two are my undershirts that I keep for when it's really cold, so I'm gonna put these in storage. I am just not super big into t-shirts. And so I have some, but the main time I wear them is for working out and I just prefer to wear an actual workout top like this. Don't know quite yet what I'm gonna keep. I just really don't like the look of these. I honestly just prefer getting a plain top. Literally, I can find them at Walmart and I'm sure I could find them at thrift stores too. So, mm. what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put them in storage and see if I reach for any of them. And if I don't by literally in a month because it's already warm enough to wear them, then I'm gonna get rid of them. But this yellow one, I know for sure I do not want. There are a few that I am gonna keep up here. A few of these are athletic shirts, which no, I got rid of the one I didn't like. So these are all good at the moment. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and keep this one for now. I think my style has just changed a lot and some of these clothes I've had for a really long time. So that makes it a little hard because I am also always changing my style. So I think, oh, I could dress this up to be a certain way, but in all actuality, some of these things probably aren't my style, but at least I have more space now. And I think if I would reach for most of these pieces, then I would actually wear them. I think what I definitely will be doing is if I buy any more winter clothes, I guess it won't happen anytime soon, but whenever I do buy long sleeve shirts, then I'll probably see if there's one in the same color that I don't like as much and then I'll get rid of that. Okay, and now on to the bottom. Oh, actually, I do have stuff right here. I have two hats that I wear along with a winter hat, which that's gonna go into storage. I have some other hats, I think, still at my parents, and I think this is making me realize I just need to get rid of those because clearly I'm not wearing those anymore. These two sweaters I wear, this I wear, this I wear, this I wear, this. Decided I'm not a fan. Nope. Donation. I just stuck a bunch of the hangers over here. I don't even know if I'm gonna keep these hangers because I don't like these ones as much. I just use them when I ran out of my felt ones. So there should probably be a sign, right? Oh well. Okay, my scarves. Oh, this makes me a little sad. Let's see. I made this scarf by finger knitting or whatever it's called but I literally never wore it. And I don't know if I would. Huh, I'll think about this one. This one's a no, it's just not really my style anymore. Uh-oh. Okay, 
after looking in the mirror, I did decide that I am going to keep this at least one more year and see if I can give it a good wear. I wear this, I wear this, and I wear that, and I wear that one. I don't know yet if I'm going to try to store my sweat, my scarves away yet or not, but we shall see. It depends on how much room I have in those storage containers. I wear this, I wear, ay, ay, ay. I literally wear this for not nice things. Well, I'll keep it for right now. It's for like when I do things that I know I'm gonna get super sweaty and possibly a little dirty because I don't care as much about that shirt. I am getting rid of this, it's so tight. So, so tight. It fits, but it's very uncomfy. Doing the declutter is already making me want to go shopping, and that's not supposed to be <laughs> what decluttering does, but I'm just realizing that I really don't have much spring summer wear, so we'll see if I can find some things I like, but it's not, it's not a rush. I'm not, it's not an urgent thing that I need to do. And now here we are with my shoes. These are all my spring summer ones, so I haven't really touched these in a while. So these are still good. I'm gonna leave those. But I think we're just gonna turn and look at the shoes over here now. These are my house shoes. They have definitely seen better days. I don't know if I can wash them, but I'm definitely keeping these. I love them. These shoes I just bought, I like those. These are good. These were my old white ones that are falling apart, so these will actually be trash. And then these are still good. These are good. These are my friends that I'm borrowing. These, uh, this is so sad because I love these so much, but they've definitely seen better days, so these are being trashed. I even tried gluing them together, but that's why I got these to replace these. I have these that I occasionally wear. I need to see if I'll still reach for them if they're even comfy. I I don't, I'm not one to have wide feet, but ever since wearing barefoot shoes, all my other shoes just seem so tight. At least the older ones that I bought, these newer ones, I buy a bigger size so that they don't feel that way. But I just don't like them. Okay, these, not flattering, these are going. These are literally so tight, at least that's what I think it was. Yeah, this is so sad because they're great quality, but you can see there's literally dust all over them because I did not wear them for so long. That is sad that those are going. Okay, so now my dresses can hang freely. I want this one to hang freely anyways and not be touched by shoes because I'm going to be wearing it in a month. That is so much better. I can't believe those are the only shoes I would have for winter. I literally wore those and those two pretty much all the time. And then these, um, and then these for fancier occasions. I just got a trash bag to put these shoes in, but then I realized that I think I'm going to donate these because hopefully someone might get some, a little bit of use out of them because they don't look bad necessarily. They're just not comfortable for me. These are gonna be trashed. And these are also not bad, so I think I'm gonna also donate these. And I'm gonna go trash these two pairs real fast. Okay, so now I'm going to go across here. This is my ugly Christmas sweater that I made. I didn't wear it last year, but I'm gonna keep it for right now. See how that goes. This thing, I already couldn't make up my mind about this one last time either. I'm gonna have to go look. Okay, I'm gonna keep it one more time, especially because it is spring and summer now, and so hopefully I'll wear it this season and if not then that is my sign to declutter it i'm gonna move my blazers to the far side where i don't see them as well because i don't really reach for them much and 
they're more for special occasions, but I'm not willing to get rid of them. Okay, I'm realizing that this area right here is so tight, so I'm really hoping I can get rid of a few things, but so far I haven't done that great. Yes, this is trash. Again, I'm not a big t-shirt person. I'm not a big long sleeve t-shirt person or whatever, long sleeve shirt with the cuffs and all that. Skinny jeans, I keep thinking I'm gonna wear them and I just don't. Donate. Move all my skirts and shorts onto this side. I really did not wear this vest and it's a little small, so I'm gonna get rid of this. Always checking the pockets before I donate things. These pants I also don't like. Donate. These jeans are just not flattering and I always kept them for dirtier times, but I can wear my other black jeans for that. Okay, I know I have two pairs of pants in the wash, so I'm gonna leave room for those. But honestly, I'm shocked with how much I've already gotten rid of. I really didn't think there was gonna be much. So I've got these two little storage bins and I'm going to clean these out real fast. Spray this one down, vacuum this one out, and see if they might fit in there well. I don't usually use disinfectants, but I just don't know what's been in these, so I'm going to clean them that way. Using these bins are actually also clearing out the side of my room, which is perfect because I'm having visitors this weekend, and it just doesn't look nice, so it'll be nice to have that gone. I'm gonna get my other storage bin like this down too to get that down. I also, in my dresser, I have an area that I alternate from the warmer months to the colder months. And so I'm gonna pull out all my beanies and hats and gloves and then put in my bathing suits. I'm just gonna go dump all my winter clothes into this. So here are some of my summer stuff. I don't really fold my bikinis because they just get messed up in here anyways. So I just allow myself to dig through, find what I need. There we go. And now I have room for my winter clothes. I can put this back up now because it is full. I think I'm gonna put my scrubs in here because this is probably longer storage because it has a lid. Honestly, these t-shirts that I took off the hangers that I said I was gonna store I know I'm not gonna reach for them. I don't like how they look on me. Yeah, they're comfy, but I can find other comfy clothes in my closet, so I'm just gonna get rid of these. I'm gonna make sure this fits first before I put everything in. Okay, I think this will be really nice to have. Some of these I can still keep around in case it gets a little chilly, so I'm gonna keep those ones out. This is being donated. I kind of mixed all, all my sweaters with the donation pile, which was a bad idea, but I'm just gonna try to make sure that I get everything that I wanna keep.
I could fit more in here, but I think the other ones I can all still wear, possibly. So I'm just gonna put this back up for right now. Ooh. This is where I'm gonna put all my stuff I think I might <laughs> wear still. I really don't know if I actually will because it might be a little too warm, but also I know that if I'm putting this in here, I'm not gonna see it, so I'm probably not gonna reach for it. I honestly don't know how I feel about this right now. I don't love the look of the clear bins. I would love to just have two of those up there, but really don't wanna buy anything either. So I'm just gonna tell myself this is to pr preserve my sweaters so that they don't just collect dust when I'm not wearing them. I'm just gonna stick with it for right now. So I think that means I'm done then. I am just gonna call this the final product. This just isn't the most inspiring to walk into in a closet, but this will do right now. I have other things I want to spend my money on, so I am very happy with how this turned out. I seriously cannot believe the amount of stuff that I got rid of. I still feel like some of the long sleeve stuff I could possibly get rid of, but I want to have stuff that I'm bringing in and just take it out instead so that I know I still have some clothes. I mean, I knew I would have some clothes still. But I definitely do want to get some short sleeve shirts soon, but I'm not going to rush into that either. If I find something, then I might get it. Decluttering my closet the first time already made me so much more aware of what I buy. And I just know that if I don't love it, love it, and feel like I could wear this a lot during the season, then there's no point in me even buying it because I want it to be comfy. I want to feel good in it. Yeah, I think those are the main two things. I want to feel good in it and I want it to be comfy. So I think I'm just going to keep that in mind this spring and summer when I buy spring and summer clothes and hopefully just keep my closet more on the, I was going to say minimal side, but I still feel like I have a lot of clothes. So maybe just more on the side of not having clothes that I won't wear, that I can actually reach in my closet and just wear anything that I grab and be happy in it. And it was also super nice to finally have all my shoes cleaned out. I am also still loving my front closet, the small closet organization decluttering. I forgot what I called it in the video, but it was one of my favorite decluttering organizations, I think because of the tower. And that is literally the best way to store shoes. I love it so much for up front, but here this works perfectly fine. And I can see all my shoes nicely. And then once I am wearing more of my spring summer shoes, which I mainly wear sneakers anyways, then I might move some of these shoes and the sandals over to where I can see them more and switch them. But I am happy with how it is right now.